Hello Virgo, welcome on my channel. I'm gonna do your bonus for May 2024 prediction. What's happening for you? What's coming next? It's gonna be a general reading, so please take what resonates and leave the rest. Book a personal reading, everything is given in the description. Follow me on Instagram. Link is given in the description. Do not get scammed. I'll never contact you anywhere on social media. So Salmon Rising, any placement, you can watch this reading and switch the energies if you're cross watcher. Let's go. Virgo. The world. Page of Cups. Ten of Pentacles. Interesting. The cards are filling up one by one. We also have the Six of Souls. Four of Pentacles and Two of Cups. These three, three cards came up together. So I'm going to take it like that. Hmm. Someone is holding on to this love. They don't want you to move. They don't want you to move on. They want, don't want you to, to leave. This could be somebody who wants to fix or mend things between you and them. They're definitely still holding on to this love. This idea of love. You will receive a message from this person. I think this person is younger than you. They look younger or they are younger. I think this is somebody who's younger than you. Um, could be a Scorpio. Um, this is also somebody who could be very innocent. Very. They maybe want to prove their innocence. Because I'm picking up, channeling the word innocent. Um, they may be innocent, okay, or they want to... Yeah, it looks like the wave is coming. It's like they're feeling so emotional. This is somebody who's going to send you a message when they're feeling so emotional or they're feeling some type of a... It's like the family wave coming, like they're feeling all the emotions. It could be this is somebody who wants to confess their feelings to you. Like they have a crush on you, they like you. This could be somebody who lives near your house. Um, could be a neighbor or could be someone that who, who is somebody who is your distant relative or somebody that you already know. Uh, there's something involved family here, far from family or could be this is, uh, yeah, we will see, that's too much. Yeah, we have the shadow side, it's the devil by the way, king of wands, yeah, fire sign, you're dealing with a fire. Here is Leo Sag, we also have a Capricorn, definitely heavy, cap heavy on Capricorn. I'm also picking up Leo, could be also um, Aquarius. Taurus, King of Swords. Oh my God, this could be same gender relationship for some Virgos, and others of you. This is talking about. Um, yeah, you could have an option. You could have an option. One is definitely somebody that you already with the with the World card, like you already moved on, maybe with the Six of Swords. But this person is not moving on. They're still holding on to it. Um, because this connection was not good with this uh, devil presence here. This was like, maybe there was an obstacle. Maybe um, this person can't be with you because of against of the family or maybe something out of the culture, tradition, whatever was the reason. Or could be distance was the biggest thing. So this person never thought about like they can fall in love or they can be in love with you. But now maybe they, with the, with the world card, I think this person's perspective changed about this relationship. The moment you moved on or the moment you hold back from this person and stop giving to this person. Maybe they want to tell you with the two of cups like now it's equal, it's mutual. But honey, you will decide because maybe you have somebody else who have a crush on you, they like you or somebody is serious here to, to make it official. Or this could be the same person, they have a fire and air in their chart. It could be even a water. This is the main energy, but uh, there could be somebody who has a crush on you. Someone could be very obsessed with you. Someone could be yeah, having a crush on you. Could be a younger person, and this person is definitely watching your internet. Um, there could be even somebody who lives far away from you, and distant relatives, or somebody who lives in a different country, a different place, and could be a relative. Could be someone that you used to live in that place, and now you moved on. You're not living there anymore, like in that place. So this could be that person. Yes, of course, I told you there's a new love here. Okay, you have a I saw triple four, so you could be seeing it. Okay, the people who are single, I'm strongly feeling the love is coming on love is on the way that's coming. Um, there could be some type of a proposal and offer coming. 
in your family if you believe in traditional type of a marriage so this could be a proposal coming you maybe have a proposal one or two proposal here so you need to think about it who you will do or be with and one of them is definitely will be far maybe it could be this person is living in a different city or even in a different country so you will think about it you will decide uh, if you will be with this person or not okay for the for those of you who are resonating with somebody who is um, live far away from you or because I'm seeing distance six of swords in the world this person living totally in a different country or place like cross the bodies of the water ocean literally and I'm also seeing the ocean so there is somebody who is right now having a crush on you or they like you are, are you used to deal with this person because I'm seeing the devil here so it's a mutual obsession like you also like this person are you used to obsess with this person you used to have a crush on this person you used to talk to this person maybe and all of the sudden things you know hold back you stop talking or you moved on or you know things shift maybe you mentally moved on from this person or emotionally but this person is still holding on to this idea that they want to be with you maybe they fell in love who knows but they're keeping it to themselves so this person was keeping it to themselves but now they definitely want to tell you with these two kings there. It's so definitely giving me Leo and Aquarius. So it could be Leo and Aquarius axis, Ace of Cups, could be a Cancer that you're dealing with. Cancer, we also have a Scorpio. Some of you, this is you, Eyes of, Ace of Wands, yeah, two Aces on the table. You could be even starting something new and fresh in your work that's going to benefit you in the future. Uh, it could be you, you're feeling breath of fresh air for you. Like you're definitely thinking about to do something, to do something new and creative in your life. And that's definitely going to make you happy, fulfilled and excited. It could be even a new love coming. So a lot of you, it's a new love. I would go with the new love. But others of you, it could be a new beginning with somebody that you used to crush on, you used to talk to, you used to have feeling for, or you used to you know, have a, this obsession that, oh, I just want to get married with this person. You even, for some of you, even literally propose to this person. And you just even forgot about it, but they just remember it. Because this is somebody who was just all keeping it to themselves all along this, this journey. You were in this person's mind, you were in this person's heart. They fell for you. So maybe this is the time now they're going to express their feelings to you. They're going to take the leap of faith, I can see that. You even give this person butterflies. Their cup is flowing, so they need to express it. Um, this could be somebody who come off like very creative, very artistic, could be even very like bold, very attractive, very smart, very genius. This person could be even a creative I'm picking up. Um, yeah, could be an artist, could be even somebody who's like a genius, very smart person, military, army person, or could be somebody who's very like a leadership qualities. They could even own the business or they're financially independent, I can see that. And they definitely is like, this is somebody who has a house, who has a, who's ready to settle down, who's ready to, you know, move forward in this connection. So I'm seeing with the two of cups, it's like there is a mutual love here though. Even though if this is a new person, you're going to like him, you're going to love, you're going to, it could be instant attraction or instant falling in love with this person. It's going to happen very fast. Okay. Um, but I'm also picking up, you are going to decide now who you want to be with. You could be even going to get a new job that's going to help you financially improvement. Some of you, you could be taking care of your health. It's really important. It could be you, you are definitely visiting a new country, a new place. It's a big achievement for you, could be. You're thinking about to do something. Could be even a shifting into a different city or place too. That could be you're doing it or you have been thinking about it for a long time. You have been saving it. Maybe with your partner you discuss it or the person that you were living with or, or maybe even with your family. I don't know. It's like there's some type of a big move here. I'm also picking up whoever this person is. If this person's family was an issue, I think they definitely going to move away and live with you far away from their family could be far away from their hometown something like that this person has a plan okay so they're definitely going to reach out to you and I'm seeing this is somebody who's going to call you text you message you or even they're gonna reach out on the internet I can see that but there is somebody who's obsessed with you and you know it it could be this is somebody who has a crush on you because they keep telling you and they and you can even feel that this person is obsessed you can feel this person energy maybe or they're gonna tell you this could be even somebody who is going to be very, very, because if, if this is like a new beginning in love or a new person coming, I don't know, it's like giving me the new love, but it could be even a new beginning in love, like somebody that you have something going on. I'm not seeing toxic ex, no. This is somebody that you maybe had some type of issues with. 
something that you thought, oh, it's over, something like, oh, it's never going to happen. Or maybe they will never reply me, they will never talk to me, they will never confess to me, or maybe they will never, there's no way that this person likes me. No, you have no idea. You will be shocked and surprised. This person even going to get shy in front of you. They're not like that with anybody else, with the king of wands and king of swords. That's how you're going to feel special. They're going to make you feel special because they're going to be very shy in front of you. They're going to act like a child also in front of you. I'm telling you. Because you really give this person butterflies. This person is ready for a new beginning with you. And if you have nobody in your life, this is going to be an instant love and attraction. If you're moving somewhere, if you're sh shifting, if you're starting something new and fresh, this is somebody that you're going to meet. It could be even a friendship, like you're about to meet somebody who's going to be your friend, a new friend coming into your life. But this person is going to stay and going to be friend like a family to you. It's not going to be friend. You will call him him or her, your family. This is how this friend is going to be like. And I'm seeing the dog here. So this person could be born into dog here, but I'm also seeing a lot of animals. So this person could be, oh, I'm sorry. So this person could be an animal lover. Yeah, I think some of you, because I just got, it's gonna be shock and surprise for you. This is something unexpected. You're not expecting it. Um, yeah, it's loyalty. This person is going to be very loyal to you. They're going to be loyal to you. This person is going to be also very committed parent, committed partner to you, committed boyfriend, committed husband, whatever. It's like they're going to be committed wife. I think this is something commitment is very, loyalty and commitment is very important for this person. They're looking for marriage, they're looking for commitment. I also believe this is somebody who's going to directly propose you. They may be even going to invite, uh, involve their family. Yeah, I think this is somebody that you have a long-term potential with. But this is love. Two of Cups is like, you also want to like this person or you love this person or you're going to feel the attraction. You're even going to feel that they're genuine. You're going to make the effort, obviously. Yeah, paradise. Oh, you're not going to believe that. You're going to believe that some of you, it's going to be a luxurious uh, house that you're going to move in together with this person are going to live. You're not going to believe that because you're going to feel like you're in a paradise. Yeah, this is somebody who's going to make you so happy. Uh, it's like coming together, oneness. You, you're also going to be very playful with each other. Enjoying each other. Yeah, close chapter from the past. Ending. So a lot of you, you're maybe not going to choose the past person. Um, because you're going to choose this person that's coming into your life, the new person. Or um, this could be them. They're coming out of some type of a cycle. Because um, I told you, like they could be moving. It's a big move or big shift for this person. And they're ready for this big change. They're choosing love. That's you. Uh, this person could be watching your um, photographs or pictures. They definitely have a crush on you. They like you. But they, this is like this person has a deeper feelings. This looks like a person that who is falling in love. They're getting the butterflies and they keep falling. The more they look at you, the more they fall for you. Could be a Scorpio, definitely a Leo. They're going to reach out to you in the next, I think, um, 30 days. Could be this month, like especially this month. Or if it's not, then June or July. This summer season is very important. Could be Leo season also. Yeah, be careful. But I think you have a choice between two people. You're going to choose who you want to be with. So if you're single watching this video, you're not going to be single because you are going to get married or being with somebody. Are you going to fall in love with somebody? That's really going to see you later. Bye.